depression is, is it's really a state of mind, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't think it's anything, it's, it's a mental thing that people sometimes succumb to because they're not maybe some, somewhat strong enough to deal with issues that they are faced with, so. I think depression is just having to be overwhelmed and dealing with so much, so much more than we as human beings can handle, I guess. It's like the state of mind that you get in when you feel like everything's going wrong and there's nothing you can do about it. And you just be like, I want to, I just want to end it now. Like some people, I know some people like get suicidal and they just be like, I want to kill myself and get it over with. Other people will be like, I'm about to start doing drugs or I'm about to start doing, I'm about to drop out of school. I'm about to stop going to work, stuff like that. Depression is not something you can avoid. It is only something you can overcome. I think that has to do with focusing on the negative aspects too. Because um, even as positive as you want to be, sometimes it's hard to focus on the positive at all and you really get trapped in the negative. And when you're trapped in the negative and you just start to get really frustrated, um, I think that's what leads you into depression because you kind of feel hopeless sometimes and you feel like there is no solution and there's no way out. I feel like a lot of people don't have mentors to let them know Okay, well, you know what? You're not going the right way right now. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people, they, they depression just go overboard to the point where like, maybe they had a situation growing up where they got raped or they, they been through abuse or been through uh, uh, um, all these childhood problems and they never dealt with it. So they just, it, it, they lost their mind. They just in the streets and they, they, now they just, they selling their body for money. You know what I'm saying? And then you wonder why this girl on the streets and they got a story. Everybody got a story. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, that's because they never had nobody come to them and tell them, you know, this is not the right way to go. A lot of times people aren't prepared because we haven't been given the tools or the love in our lives to, uh, to deal with certain situations. And I think because of that, people end up uh, becoming frustrated, angry, and hopeless.